Welcome back to Tennis Talk. My name's Cam Williams, and we have an update on the Djokovic situation, and it seems like he is not going to be playing at the US Open this year. The CDC have reviewed their rules on international travelers who are unvaccinated coming into the country, and it looks like they haven't changed their minds. Let's go have a look at the CDC website that's been updated over the last couple of hours. So as we know, the CDC had the guidelines being reviewed, and it looks like they've been updated over the last couple of hours. This is what they say now. Under the international travel to and from the United States section, non-US citizens, non-US immigrants, you must show proof of being fully vaccinated with the primary series of an accepted COVID vaccine before you board your flight to the US. Only limited exceptions apply. And the important part of this is you can see it was updated on the 24th of August, which is today. So there you have it. The CDC have updated their guidelines, but they haven't changed the one thing that can get Djokovic into the country and play the US Open. Now, he hasn't fully withdrawn or haven't, hasn't officially withdrawn. He's still on the list, but the draw does come out in the next 24 hours. So we'll see if he does withdraw before the draw comes out. A lot of pressure from a lot of players, especially a lot of qualifiers, including Liam Brody, have been pressuring Djokovic to withdraw to give them a chance. Let me know down in the comments below. Do you think Djokovic will withdraw officially before the draw comes out? Or do you think he'll wait like he did at Indian Wells until the draw is submitted? Because he did that at Indian Wells with a lot of backlash. Do you think Djokovic will pull out before or after the draw has been given out today? 